Now, the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission has allayed fears of external influence in the management of the 2022 general elections. IBC Embu County Electoral Manager Daniel Lenarum says the electoral body is committed to delivering free and fair elections. He said claims of perceived interference in the presidential and gubernatorial elections are unfounded. Lena Ram says that IEBC is an independent commission and it shall not be influenced at any stage as announcement of results will be at the polling station and the outcome of the election will not be altered. For us to be able to have a credible, transparent election, peace is very important. It's a major ingredient in the election process. So we collaborate with them and all other stakeholders so that as we move towards the election, we have a peaceful process. He admitted that the commission has had challenges pinpointing voter bribery as the commission have less workforce to monitor the malpractice, which is widespread during the campaigns and electioneering period. DPP together with the DCIA, who are the agencies involved in that process, will always take the, the process of ensuring that uh, Whoever has broken the law, then the law will take its own course. On his part, the National Cohesion and Integration Commission has warned youth who will allow themselves to be manipulated by politicians, saying they will take personal responsibility. Make sure kwamba wanainchi wote, especially wa area yetu, eneo ya Mount Kenya. Kwa kila mtu takupanda, anatakupanda mlima. Wakipanda mlima, upande kwa amani eh wanaweza kuja watu wote sera zao bila 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 kuona ghasia yote Makori said NCIC has completed mapping out political violence hotspots in the country ahead of next year's August 9 polls and have also embarked on a countrywide civic education and advocacy for peace and unity prior to the general election so hit your team